best wishes from, best wishes from, best wishes from. <laughs> Hello girls, it is Saturday, April 25th and today is awesome because in real life I'm not in my backyard. I'm actually in London. I'm in London with four of my friends who are all on my volleyball team and yes, this actually means that we got a hotel. It's the Dolphin Hotel and I'm not sure about the quality, but we'll see if I survive. Just a little fun fact, while we were researching hotels we found one that had a room that consisted of a double bed and a shower booth in the middle of the room. Without any kind of curtain, the door was just made of glass. What? We got free train tickets to go to London. They couldn't send it to my home, but had to send it to Brussels. And I want to bet right now that when we get to Brussels, the tickets will not be there. Come on, free tickets? I don't trust it. Last time I was in London, I did all the touristy things. So this time we're going to Shakespeare's Globe to see a Romeo and Juliet. We're going to visit King's Cross Station, you know, with platform nine and three quarters. And of course we're going shopping. I really need some new dinosaur socks. Two days ago I got the news that I got accepted to Elmhurst College in Chicago in America. I'm really, 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 really excited and terribly scared at the same time. Now I can finally start doing my research. I mean, I gotta know the school colors and the mascot and perhaps even... Do they have a song? I'm gonna be so prepared. Of course, I'm gonna be an English major, but I still have to pick all my courses, so that's gonna be difficult. The introduction week starts August 24th. In the beginning of August, I'm going to Italy on holiday, and when I get back, I'll have four or five days to say goodbye to everyone, and then I'm leaving. I wonder what my roommate will be like. Nerdy, I hope. Some bad news? I got fired. I can no longer call myself a high school English teacher. I only was one for three months, but I got really attached to the kids, and I feel sorry that I have to go. Hmm. No kids, no monies. Yeah, I'm gonna have to find a way to make some money, or I'm in big, big trouble. Yonika and Levi are both reading the books that they borrowed from me. I think that Yonika finished The Hunger Games in about three days and really loved it, and was mad at me because she didn't do any of her college work. And Levi is still reading The Host and she also likes it. I'm still reading The Time Traveler's Wife. I still cannot wrap my mind around it, but it's really awesome. So girls, right now I'm probably somewhere drinking some nice tea. I'll see all of you next week, and Yonika, I'll see you tomorrow. As always, best wishes! Meh, meh, meh.